if you look down here, you'll see there's a few colours there, and then there's quite a few more here. And it's from a company called uh, Full Spot in uh, Italy. They're an Italian design company, and they have lots of different watch straps. I think there's about 20 odd, and they're six euros each, so you kind of get a bit carried away. And there's also lots of different faces. I think I have three of them. And they're only about 12, 15, 18 euros for more expensive ones. So the problem is, you buy a couple, you think they're nice, and then one day you get up and you think, oh, I can't wear that, because it looks ridiculous, and you buy another one. And that's how you end up where I am. So there you go. What a nice way to start a Saturday. Oh, look, the flowers are out. And if you look over here, it is still flipping Q Gardens on a balcony. Welcome to another episode of Toby Stupid Vlog. It's another lovely day in the alleyways of Kew. I'm going to do a bit of shopping because the sun's out and it's summer, but it's here, over there it actually looks like it might be autumn. Um, so I've got to make the most of it because I have this feeling that next week is just going to be like shit. So um, yeah, carpe diem and all that. And anyway, uh, Crystal's gone to the hairdressers so I won't see her till this afternoon. So I've got to occupy myself by buying things I don't need and that kind of stuff. You know how it is. I've come to Kingston to do some shopping and um, we're in Tiger which sells lots of amazing things. I'm buying two pairs of sunglasses because they're four quid. Look, you can buy an actual baby in a box to put the baby in. That's to hang your cakes on. Pulled up Frisbee. So this is the this is the road back from Kingston past Petersham. Uh, somewhere along here on the right is uh, Brad and Angelina's house. Um, true fact, but most people probably don't realise that, but if you ride the 65 bus, which is just ahead of us, and you sit on the top deck coming out of Kingston, then eventually you pass this house with two giant topiary um, elephants in the garden, which, uh, which is on the right up here, and that is where Brad and Angelina live. It's not that one, hang on, it's this one on the right here. It's this one, it's that one there. Not that one. That one with the black gates. That's Brad and Angelina's place. So, we're just taking some time off from Vino booking strippers. Do we know about Trafalgar Square? I'm looking for Trafalgar Square. I'm trying not to shoot your crotch, but it's... Very tight. If you do, you know there's a peanut that's a large quarry bike. That's how I've heard. Out for a walk. See, look, danger ducks, and there they are. Actual ducks. Now I've got to not get hit by the car. If you can hear Heather Small in the background, that's because she is performing at Cue the Music, which is in Kew Gardens that way. And, well, this is looking busy. The Kew Pond is gone a bit mental. Welcome to a very wet 25 past 6 in the morning. Yes, I'm going to work at 25 past 6. In fact, I'm going to the O2 first, but it's not supposed to be raining, so let's see if this actually happens. Well, we're, th we're there. I mean, or rather we're there. And that's got to be a good start, right? It's 10 past 7. Didn't take very long. I do have to find where the actual entrance to up is, and it is pouring with rain, but other than that, Some beautiful looking people. Video, because I think the world needs to see you like this. <laughs> Kevin's wearing. Do you want to see my pencil? <laughs> that is just pimping. Strange places to do a link from.
inappropriate breakfast. Oh no! Chloe's <laughs> <laughs> oh, spilling food over herself. It's going well. Mmm, cheers. Right, so it's seven o'clock in the evening. It's been a very long day because I had to get up at stupid o'clock and then climb a giant building in the pouring rain. Pouring rain. It was beautiful yesterday and this morning it was absolutely awful weather. So what is it like when I get home at seven o'clock? Yeah, summer. Unbelievable behaviour, frankly. I'm very disappointed in you whether, you know, try harder because otherwise there'll be trouble. Anyway, um, I think it's time for a takeaway. It's a Friday night and it's been a very long week. One more week, then holiday. So I'm gonna sign off. I'm gonna leave you to enjoy your day and continue procrastinating, no doubt. Um, so anyway, see you later.